We have some good baseball in store. It's going to be the Minnesota Twins and the Tampa Bay Rays. Major League Baseball, only on 2K Sports. Home team support, you bet, and a lot of it. Some 36,000 fans here. The home turf advantage, Tampa Bay will have it. Their hometown fans looking to see some offense. Thank you for joining us Thursday night, Major League Baseball on 2K Sports. Here's a look at our starter for Tampa Bay. Steve, focus here against Minnesota. Well, I guess the lineup like this, even though you've got a good right-hander on the mound, he's got a chance to have some damage done. He has to believe in damage control. Give up one run, but don't give up a crooked number. On guard and higher, ready to go. Here's his lineup. Well, contact is the name of the game for this lineup. These guys go up there looking to swing the bat and make contact and put the ball in play and challenge the defense. And we'll take a look at Scales as he comes to the plate. First pitch coming up. Ball. Too far outside, 1-0. A win in their last contest for the Twins. They went too straight, taking both games of the two-game series against the Royals. On well, this ball club's been playing pretty well of late. Six wins in their last ten games. And a lot of this has to do with their patience they're showing at home plate. Right and he looks at a sinker in there. One and one. And they really have been working the count, waiting for their pitch, and uh, it's paid off. And the last thing you want to do when something is working is change the plan. Stick with it, and they'll continue to win. One one pitch. Runs up to bunt, gets this one down. First out of the game. Now's a good time to take a quick look at how the Rays will be taking the field on defense. And fans, look out for next Tuesday. Broadcast from Oriole Park, the Orioles at home. They'll face the visiting Minnesota Twins. Start time, 7 o'clock Eastern. A chance to watch two good teams matching up in that one, Gary. I'm look, really looking forward to it. Now the Rays coming in off a loss. And with that loss, they end up going one for three in the series against the Red Sox in Boston. First pitch. First pitch way out of the zone. Ball one. So you take a look back here. They came away losing one run in the game. And one run's just not going to get it done on most days. The 1-0 now. Fastball just misses, and he falls behind 2-0. Well, he tried to go outside on the outside corner with that fastball right there. Just got a little bit off the plate. He's got to be careful, though. You don't want that hitter to get his arms extended. Fastball just misses. He runs it to 3-0. A 3-0 count right here. Hey, look, I'm giving the hitter the green light and letting him swing away to see if he can do some damage. Pitch on the way. Not looking at a fastball. Three and one now. Well, he gets the strike, and it was just a get-me-over pitch right there. He better not throw that same pitch on 3-1, though. That misses ball four. That is a guy you do not want to put on base. He went with a fastball and three-ball count, which is what you want to do most often. He just couldn't throw a strike. Here's the offensive lineup for the Rays. Okay, this is what I call a circular lineup. Stars really throughout the lineup are all the same. They hit for average, hit for power, drive in runs, really star studded throughout.
Flew out last time. They better be careful, Gary, with him on second base. He can run. And he has the ability to read the pitcher and get a good jump as well. 1-0 count. He took that last one, and it was out of the zone. Well, he tried that four-seam fastball up in the zone to get him the chase. Tough pitch to lay off of. Good job by the hitter. He makes contact. Line drive. That'll be a base hit at an RBI. And he scores. Well, what a good piece of hitting right there. The pitching has been very good. Made one mistake right there, and he gets that RBI across the board to give his team some momentum. Number three slot up again here. This is his first year in the majors. Two men on, one out. Here's the first pitch. Trying to get down the bunt right there, but he missed it for a strike. Here's the pitch. And this is inside, and that hit him hard. Well, the ball just sailed away from him, couldn't control it, now it loads the bases. Well, this is a make-or-break moment in this game. Time for some decisive pitching. Some hot water right here, Steve. Bases loaded, only one away. Well, it's still early in the game, but everyone in the ballpark understands what an important at-bat this is in this situation. It could impact the rest of the game. First pitch on the way. Right down Main Street for a strike on one. Look, Gary, that's a great four-seam fastball, but when you lay it down the heart of the plate, you know you're at risk for the ball getting tattooed. Unfortunately, the hitter didn't swing. Strike Looks two. at a fastball in there, and it's quickly 0-2. to get him to golf with that one but he lays off and uh, one two count oh it's a great fastball right there down in the strike zone now there's so many ways to go let's see how he comes back to attack this hitter swings and grounds this one to the right side foul fastball got him two down He's got some real giddy up on the fastball today. It's got that good late action in the zone. That's his fifth strikeout on the fastball. Bases are loaded with two down. He delivers. Ball. Fastball misses away. 1 0. Right. And he looks at a fastball in there. 1 and 1. A nice four seamer right there. That one's clearly on the outside corner. He hit the spot. Now the 1-1 pitch. There's a swing towards the hole. Throws to first in time. That's three down. First run of the game, third inning. They'll try to build on that momentum. The Rays lead it one to nothing. Things will start getting a little more difficult as we look to the third man to lead it off. For those of you just coming on board, Gary... Thorne with Steve Phillips and John Cruck bringing you Major League Baseball on 2K Sports.
And he's got that steely look on his face right now, and why not? Two in scoring position, only one away. That lead in danger. Uh, Adam, he's not interested in giving up that lead, so he's going to go right at this Ball guy. One. Sinker just missed. One and oh. Well, Gary, into the fourth inning right here now. They, they've gotten three hits in this one, so they've had a few base runners, but they haven't been able to lump them together to be able to generate any runs so far. Right sinker one. waved at and missed. One and one. When you say ground ball, that's what that sinker down of the zone is meant to do. Now the 1-1. One, one. And he watches one at the knees, and it's 1-2. and two. You throw the sinker ball to get the ground ball out. He got the called strike right there. If they swing, he's going to get his share of ground balls. The 1-2 on its way. Here's a swing and a line drive. And there's one. Oh, boy, they simply throw to the wrong base. With two outs now. Those runners are still standing on base. Let's see if he can find his way out of this with the lead intact. Runners at second and third and two down. And the first pitch. The 0-0 delivery of fastball taken for a strike. He looked like he was ready to swing that time at the plate, Gary, but he must have been looking for a different pitch as that fastball just paints the outside corner. And here's the delivery. Ball. Missed with the fastball outside, and it's even at one. Fourth inning of this game, and right now he's finding himself over 20 pitches here. And that is eating away at his overall pitch count total, so uh, he may not be around for long. Here's the pitch. Change up just off the black, and it's two and one. Taps this one foul to the right. That one swung on its line. That's caught. Side is retired. They give two men in scoring position. Couple of hits. Can't get them home, though. So the shutout's still in progress here at Tropicana Field. And it rolls around to the top. Top again. He's ready to start the home half here in the fourth inning.
getting close now to the top of the order so you want this pitcher spot always you want it to be an out even if you get that here there's still going to be a couple of outs to work with to create some offense picks it up out. over to first for out number one look where he placed that one right there take a look at it perfectly placed he is out at first, but the damage was done around the bases. Those runners now in position to score. That's good situational baseball. Runners at second and third, only one away. And he's breaking for the plate. Drops down a butt up with it and he's in there what a daring steal of home plate you will not see that very often and he comes in to score and they have snatched that lead good productive out good productive at bat picking up the RBI nice piece of hitting uh, Gary it's strength against strength right now in a critical situation Steve great determination by this offense it looks like they may take charge of this ball game late well they were given an opening and they took it and now they have a lead late in the game the pitch plays off that fastball and it's 0 and 2 Steve we'll keep an eye on the bullpen we'll expect to see that closer getting up and getting ready to come into the ball game well that's right but you want to give your closer some insurance give him some margin for error so look for this guy to try to come up with a big hit to tack on to this lead One two pitch coming. Two and two. Fastball just about had him, and it's a two two count. Well, that pitch right there just seemed to get away from the pitcher, took off on him. Looked like he tried to overthrow that a little bit. Here's the pitch. Oh! That misses below the knees. That'll run us to the full three two count. Well, anytime you have a good fastball and you can keep it down in the zone, around the knees or lower, it's great location, and believe me, very difficult to hit. And this has popped up on the left side. And that's the third out. That'll do it. They pick up two, three hits, strand a man. Minnesota taking the lead here. Now we're seeing them put the heat on. The top of the order is due up next. Number nine spot at the plate. again one for two in the ball game he singled his last trip two outs bases empty and the first pitch he swings now and really hit that and Hardy grabs that one, and the side's retired. And they go quietly offensively in this half inning, nothing across. The Twins still out in front. And it's Hardy batting. Ground out victim last time through.
Well, nobody out. Runner on at second here. How about a bunt, Steve? And you have to think they're going to bunt the ball to the third baseman. Make him give up the bag so you can advance the runner. And he lays one down here. Collins in time for the out. Here's how the Eastern Division standings look in the very early going now, courtesy of State Farm. It's the Rays in first. It's the Blue Jays in second. Orioles third place. Red Sox seated fourth. And down at the bottom, the New York Yankees. Well, they're definitely everybody's team once again this year. And they got it done last season to prove that they're the elite team in the American League East right now. Man on third with one away. First pitch to him. Headed for the middle. Look out off the pitcher. And he throws to first in time. Out number two. But a quick recovery that time gets the out. A late inning showdown right now. And he's got a chance here with a runner in scoring position, Steve, to get this thing knotted. Well, the pitcher's got to find a way to retire this hitter and not let this run score. Clutch at bat here. Man on third, two down. And here's the pitch. Starts him off with a strike down the heart of the plate. As a hitter, you don't want to fall too far behind in the count. Right now, you want to be able to know what pitch he's going to throw. Oh. Low for a ball, one and one. Now, if you're going to miss, this is where you want to miss. Throw that breaking ball at the bottom of the strike zone. If the hitter swings and puts it in play, it's a ground ball out. A swing line to left center. And it gets down. So the pitcher comes in trying to close this one out. He leaves a pitch in a bad spot. Now we're all tied up again. He has to shut this thing down and give his offense a chance to come back and win it. And the number seven batter in the box. He's really looking to keep this going. There are. however two down well a gapper could be a game winning base hit here so look for the outfield to play nothing over their head and that runner at first will be flying on contact in this situation he's got to come up with something very special late in the ball game and a tie game Look here, this is as focused as I've ever seen this pitcher be. In fact, he looks angry out there. He's got the right frame of mind. Now he needs to make the right pitch. And that finds the outside corner for strike one. A good life on this fastball as he just buries it down and away. The pitch. He swings and drives this one. That's two gone. Runners on the move. The throw... That's going to break the tie. They lead by one. A productive hit. Checking the WPA graph, let's measure what the RBI means. Well, I'll tell you what, he's out there, and you, you're counting on him maybe to drive the ball to the wall, but instead, they'll take it. A productive out picking up a run. Here's a look at the teams that uh, drummed up the extra base hits last year, our State Farm leaderboard. Number one, the Blue Jays. The Red Sox in second. Third, the Yankees. The Twins fourth. And at number five on the list, the Rays. Well, look for the ball to be rattled around in the, in the gaps in this game. The balls are going to be hitting the wall. Extra base hits galore with these two teams, two of the best at it last year in the league. And I tell you what, these guys oh. love to hit the ball in the gaps and get in scoring position with one swing of the bat. And the number eight spot rolls around. And I have a feeling he's taking a real good look at the fact the bases are loaded. A uh, base hit here will give him a much-needed insurance run. Two outs. Bases loaded. First pitch. Here it comes. This one's pretty well hit to deep left center. And the side's retired as they head into the dugout. Well, they pick up a run on two hits, and they leave a couple. Minnesota taking the lead here. Now we're seeing them put the heat on. And for those of you just joining in, I'm Gary Thorne along.
talking with John Cruck and Steve Phillips. We bring you Major League Baseball here on 2K Sports. They are still in this ball game, even though they're trailing here in extra innings. He's the potential tying run. Well, Gary, this is the stuff that makes heroes. Both guys know the weight of the game is on their shoulders. Strike Sinker's ball. in there. No balls and a strike. Here's the pitch. He lets that fastball go by for a called strike, 0 2. Fans are on their feet right now. They know two strikes on the hitter. They need to keep this thing going. Here's the pitch. He swings and nails a liner. And it's in there, the tying run on board. Here's the start of the Central Division race, courtesy of State Farm. Don't be surprised to see it change as the season progresses. First place, the Indians. Twins in the second spot. The Tigers, third place. Fourth place, the White Sox. And it's the Royals in last place. Six slide up at the plate again. He's had one hit four times up. Well, definitely going to have to hold the runner close at first base. He can run. And boy, if he gets to second base, he's in scoring position and could tie this one up. Just missed with the fastball. 1-0. Well, I tell you what, the offensive team is really doing a good job right now. You never want your closer to throw over 30 pitches, but that's where they have him right now. Let's see if they can try to finish him off. Here's the delivery. This is the inside corner that time. 2-0. Well, Gary, this guy has an outstanding slider. Such a tough pitch to hit. It almost needs a turn signal when it gets to the plate. Oh. And he lays off that one. It's inside for ball three. Well, Gary, you talk about his slider. What makes it so tough to hit him is that the break on that pitch is so big and it's so hard, it's very tough on the hitter to center the ball. Missed with that. And now the possible winning run is on. He threw that one off the plate, maybe guessing that the guy had a green light 3-0, but he's got to find the strike zone again. Oh, this is a biggie right here. A great matchup right now, Gary. Well, this could very well be their last shot. Possible tying and winning runs on base. He just needs to concentrate on putting it in play and hitting it hard. Doing it with two down. Two men on and two men out. 